Hi there, here is Tommy and I tell you something about Slovakia, about living here. One month ago we celebrated big anniversary and this anniversary it was 20 years from the end of communism. It was on the 17th of November. Uh, we celebrated that we are independent and we are capitalistic and democratic and whatever, but I don't think there is really that much to celebrate because conditions in which we live are still communistic. I will show you a place where I live, my place, or basically my mom's place, and you will see. Basically, when we moved to this place, I was one and a half year old, my brother was just newly born, and my parents were together. It was in 18, oh, sorry, 1985, for a long time ago, and we were one of the first people live in this block of flats. Basic idea was to create some place for young families, for people to have a normal peaceful life, people go to work, uh, there is a care about their kids and everything is in one part. It's kind of sector. And this happened in 1986. We moved here and we were quite lucky because three years later there was the end of communism and like there are no new flats or people they stopped building because it became very expensive and it's not affordable anymore. Uh, these flats are special because <laughs> they are exactly the same. Like if you walk to the flat you exactly know where is the kitchen, where is the kids room, where is room for parents and also you know uh, where is the living room. and. Before, there were even like the same <laughs> wallpapers in every, every single flat and people were meant to be equal and now I will show you what I mean by being equal. So come with me. This means being equal. Same, 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 same. Ugly building. Same, same, same. Well, this is just one yard. If you go there, behind this tree there is a gate and you will get to the same yard, which looks like this. You cross the road and there is again, again such a one yard. What's this ugly building in front of me? Well, this ugly building in front of me, uh, it used to be kindergarten. It was built to serve needs of these buildings. And there is, there is exactly one more kingdom garden uh, if you go to the, not the second but to the third yard. Thing is that that time people thought, oh, everyone has money, we will have a kids, we have a good job. But they didn't expect what gonna happen in 2009 and I mean in the 21st century. People don't have work, people don't buy flats because they are three times, four times more expensive. They cannot afford even kids. So basically, this is useless. Before, we used to have such a playground. Like you see here. There was such a playground over there. And one over there, when you see this parking sign. There was a sand for small kids, and usually mothers during the week were here out with their kids, fathers during the weekend, they were reading newspapers and kids were playing in the sand. But people found out we have no parking space. So there you see at the back, behind this car, people had some places by road. But we are in year 2009, it's not enough. So what happened? People just built this parking place. And they took all the, the grass here, all the plain grounds, and so on and so on. Another thing, there is a school behind this flat. This school is a huge, 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 and it was meant to uh, to accommodate like all the students in uh, this borough. And it started, or it was built during communism but they didn't finish gym so this gym have there haven't been any gym for 15 years and also pattern change people they decided where to get their 
where, uh, where, where the kids go to school by quality, not by location. So basically this school was empty because no one wanted to go there. And simply this is the way how it works in Slovakia still, even we are 20 years after communism. Yeah, by the way, everyone is welcomed here. Lovely place to live, isn't it? It's a very difficult question. I would say it depends. It depends like everything in life. It doesn't mean like if you live here that you are unhappy. It's just the way how the things are.